in a couple of weeks time, just after half term, we have GCSE resits coming up. And if you are in the unfortunate position of having to resit them, then you'll know this is not a hugely fun place to be. So what I really, really want for you is to only have to resit it once and to pass it this time. So I am desperately trying to convince you it is really worth putting the time in, it is really worth putting the effort in, it is really worth putting the energy into passing it now so that we don't have to reset it again and again and again because I have heard horror stories of people having to reset these exams up to nine times and we do not want that for you. I want you to reset it once and then that's it. We've got our grades and we've moved on. So here are my top five things to do in preparation for the resets to make sure that we actually pass it this time and we do not need to do it again because nobody wants to do those again. My number one thing for you to do is to go and watch my whole topic video. It is not very long. I've cut out all the stuff that you don't need so it's just the stuff that you need for foundation level. And this will take you through all of the, the skills that you need and if there's anything in there you don't recognise you can go and look it up in one of the other videos. It is not long. It is only an hour and a half long. You don't even have to watch it like one time speed. You can do it two times speed to make it even faster. To go with that, number two, is that there are predictive papers. You can download these from my website. They will cost you £1.49 and you'll get them absolutely immediately. £1.49 is an absolute bargain to avoid having to resit them again in June and then again next to November and then again next to June. I'm trying to keep costs really, really low because I want to help you so, so much, but I do have to pay for like checking on stuff, which is why I do have to charge them. I hate doing it, but the predictor papers are ready and waiting for you over on my website. They've been specifically written for this exam series. Um, so it's like, what do we think? What came up last time? What do we think is going to come up this time? To help you go with that, if you find any topic that you don't understand, number three is the 100% free multiple choice questions that are available on my website. You can just go on my website, you don't need to log in, don't need to give me your email address or anything. Just go to my website, try the questions, and then it will take you through to the answer at the end. I'll tell you whether you got it right, tell you whether you got it wrong. You can use this for revision. Number four is that to go with the predicted papers, we have live workshops where a qualified teacher, used to be head of maths, is going to be working you through all of these papers. So you can see exactly how we get from one step to another step, you can see exactly how we do this, you can see exactly what the working is, exactly what all the different command words mean. We have loads of these going on over half term. And then number five thing to do if you really, really are struggling, if you really, really want to try and get those grades, is to book some intensive sessions with a tutor. Links to all of these things, the predictive papers, the whole topic video, where to find a tutor, where to find the workshops are all in the description down below. But it is really, really worth putting the time, putting the effort in. Even if you have spent a little bit of money, like getting a tutor um, to, to actually push you to get past, I promise you, if we pass it this time and you only have to reset it once, it's 100% worth it. Ouch! This is why in some videos I have unexplained scratches.